Hello there everyone! Omar Busapix here again, back again with another video. So, we'll be uh, discussing a certain topic, a very important topic, yeah? Okay, so, like a very important topic. We'll be discussing, yeah, two Muslim YouTubers. We'll be discussing two Muslim YouTubers, yeah? Yeah, um, and what happened to them, and why, what, what happened to them is bullshit. And, and should not have uh, happened in the first place. Yeah? So yeah, let's get started. So, um, this is a channel. Um, it belongs to a Muslim YouTuber in Egypt, by the way. He, like, does, like, response videos. Like, he responds to, like, Coptic Christians. Like, and he's very polite in his responses, by the way. He's like very like uh, polite, like he does not insult, he does not use insults like me, like I do. Um, he like makes very well made, high quality videos. Uh, he, he like, he has a good gaming computer by the way, like I saw, I, I saw at it uh, in one of the backgrounds. So yeah, and I recommend you guys to like uh, subscribe uh, to this channel. Now I know it's like um, kind of in English, but no, I mean Arabic, most of his videos are in Arabic. But there are like some English subtitled videos, and I plan to do an Arabic uh, version of these videos that you're watching right now. Uh, right now, so yeah, uh, I'll be discussing why he got imprisoned. Uh, I have a theory with why he got imprisoned. Okay, so this guy, like at the beginning of this year, yeah, um, like he was arrested, and this, he, there is his, there is a post. Yeah, there is his post. As you can see here, he probably got, got tortured. But the Egyptian police officers, and he probably got uh, was forced. He probably was forced to shave off his beard. He he discriminated against him, which is bullshit. Like this is bad. This is bad. This shouldn't have have happened in Egypt, by the way. So yeah, like uh, I don't like how he got treated that way in Egypt. Like in Egypt is an Islamic country. You have no excuse to treat him that way. He's not like a. He's not. He does not talk about politics. He does not like support like terrorism. Like he does not like do, do any of that. Like he's just like a Muslim who's who loves the the, the Prophet Muhammad Sallam, who loves Allah. Yeah, and he makes the response videos to people who who, who like who, to Christians, to Coptic Christians, including the ones that like hate Islam and hate Muslims. So yeah, so, so yeah, yo, like in, uh, anyone who like uh, who put him in jail has no excuse to put him in jail at all, at all, at all. At all, so yeah, so yeah, it's unfair. So they leave uh, the Sharif Gabriel's like lawyer who insulted the Prophet Muhammad Ali Yeah, uh, uh, like uh, 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 free, they leave him free. Yeah, and he sides with Khalid Muntasser, a dirty liberal. Yeah, a dirty liberal. Yeah, who uh, who. <laughs> Who like uh, doesn't uh, doesn't want Muslims to go to the Hajj? Who complains about Muslims going to the Hajj? Who like uh, who sides uh, with enemies of Islam? Like this guy uh, who wants to to implement gay rights in Egypt? Yeah, that's what he wants. And I see a lot of uh, a, a lot of anti-Muslim Christian Coptic Christian uh, filthy degenerates supporting him. Even though uh, he has beliefs that are that do not uh, that are not compatible with these, uh, with their values. So yeah, including this guy. This guy supports Khalid Muntasser and uh, and his boyfriend. Yeah, his boyfriend, Chief Gabber's uh, lawyer. Chief Gabber is an atheist, by the way, who like does videos, anti-religion videos. So yeah, uh, it's unfair that this guy got imprisoned. Yeah, and he got tortured. Yeah, in prison. Yeah, and he got tortured in prison. Yeah, he was beaten. And absolutely look at him, like he got, he, he looked at him, man. like he looks like he, he ended up being humiliated and beaten, like that. Like it's bullshit that the Egyptian government did that. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. It's absolute bullshit. Yeah, this is absolute bullshit. Oh yeah, by the way, by the way, his channel is is way more useful than all of the channels of these filthy labors like Islam Bayairi, Akhair Muntasser, Ibrahim Isa. So yeah, I mean like, it's a shame. It's a shame that he got in prison like this. Shame on someone who imprisoned him, uh, them. So yeah. 
so yeah, like guys, I recommend you, you download his videos. I, 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 his channel might be at risk of being deleted by the Egyptian government. Yeah, uh, well, not all of it, but some elements of it. Some like a cold, weak, liberal, pussy elements of it. So yeah, uh, I'll do a video on that soon. So yeah, uh, this is absolute bullshit. Um, he, he shouldn't have been report, uh, arrested at all. Egypt is that Islamic countries they have no excuse to the, to like imprison like a, a Muslim YouTuber who does like videos defending Islam. And Muslims. So yeah, they, they have no excuse to imprison him like that. And the vast majority of Egyptians are Muslim. So you like the is, is, uh, is the people who imprison him should not have been imprisoned him at all. He's not a terrorist. He's not a Muslim brother member. He's not like uh, anything, anything, anything of that sort. Um, so yeah. Um, now he is a proud Muslim brother who supports Islamic law. Uh, just like most Muslims in this world support Islamic law. So yeah, which is good. He's a proud Muslim brother. He's not one of those filthy degenerate. Yeah, liberal scum, P liberal Muslim pussy vagina um, scum. Yeah. <laughs> who like uh, who like sides with, who side with the enemies of Islam and side with the enemies of Allah. So yeah, guys. Now, after all that done, okay. Now. I have a theory on why he was imprisoned. You see, uh, our president, Abdel Fattah al -Sisi. Now, I don't know if he knows this, like if he was responsible, directly responsible for this or not, but he might be. He might be. He might be. And he, been, he has been doing some stuff recently that I don't agree with this, that I don't agree with, and I don't like at all. Um, and now, I don't think he's as bad as most people, well, it depends, but he, he, it, 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 it depends if he's like, if he's confused or he's, he's actually intentionally doing it, um, if, uh, if he's bad or not. He could be, he could be just like a confused individual and like he, like he does not strike me as one of those like Muslims that are ashamed of themselves and are, are liberal, um, but he, but he, he's for certain confused. Well, not for certain, but like I'm pretty sure he's more likely confused than like intentionally being liberal. So yeah. Um, so yeah, I have a theory, okay? So this guy, uh, Ahmad Sbia, his name, he, he, that's his name. He like mm, made the Coptic Church or like the Coptic Pope like mad at and mad at him um, because he does like really well made, re really good response videos, and he ends up like crushing people in debates. Uh, he makes response videos, yeah, uh, to, to like uh, pe uh, to evil people. Like uh, to, to, he makes response videos to people like Zakaria Butters, who someone who like who hates the prophet, who insults the prophet in his show. He who makes uh, unjust accusations of the prophet. Uh, he makes like uh, unjust Zakaria Butters. He makes like unjust accusations. Against the prophet, if that's the correct word to use, or to the pro well, um, against the prophet. Um, he make uh, Zachary Bortos makes unjust accusations against the prophet Muhammad. So, yeah, um, so yeah, this guy have been like making videos, like responding to Christian uh, to some Christians, like this, like. This like uh, priest, this priest, and he makes response videos to like uh, Coptic priests, and like he, and like the Coptic church got mad at him, yeah, for doing these videos, yeah. Um, so they made like an underground, uh, well, like behind the scenes, like deal with CC, so they could imprison him and try to like torture him until he deletes his channel. Because the Coptic Christians like, like they're they're afraid like that like, uh, like the Coptic Pope is afraid that he, his videos might like make make the Christians 
uh, in Egypt, um, it might like he's a Coptic pope is afraid that yeah, he's is that he's a Coptic pope is afraid that Ahmed Spears videos might make some of the Christians in Egypt become Muslim or consider becoming Muslim. So he's a he's afraid of that. So he made like a behind behind the scenes deal with CC to imprison Ahmed Sabir. So Ahmed Sabir could be tortured until he like deletes his channel. Now they probably like tortured him uh, until like they, they like f uh, like like they weren't able to like uh, uh, to get him to delete his channel. So they like so he had to let them go. Everything like that. So yeah. So yeah, uh, like it should, uh, this thing should not have happened to be uh, to begin with. He didn't insult people. Like like I wonder if uh, I, I wonder if he what what how would he react if he saw my videos and my content? Because I'm more aggressive than him. By the way, I, I don't tolerate the bullshit of well, I do not tolerate the bullshit that Islam Islamophobes like uh, spout out. So yeah. I don't tolerate the bullshit that the anti-Muslim uh, Republicans and anti-Muslim Christians spout out. I don't tolerate the stuff that the anti-Muslim Christians and anti-Muslim Republicans say. Or yeah, see, I don't tolerate. The, yeah, uh, I have. Uh, I do not tolerate the uh, things. I do not tolerate the things. The, uh, the, um, I don't tolerate the I do not tolerate the stuff that so, uh, um, ah, be, I'm trying to like re, like compose a sentence I do not tolerate the stuff that Santa Christians well, not anti. Let me see. I do not tolerate the stuff that the anti-Muslim Christians and anti-Muslim Republicans say about Muslims. So, so yeah, uh, so yeah, uh, this guy makes like YouTube videos. I I, I recommend all Muslim. Well. Yeah, all Muslims watching this, my video to go to his channel, subscribe to his channel, and watch all of his videos. He's really good. He's he's a very unique uh, looking Egyptian, by the way. Like he's like a he's like a, 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 um, like a redhead and like a blue eyed uh, white redhead, which is really rare for an Egyptian. Like I don't know if he's actually Egyptian or like p pure Egyptian or like is he like mixed with something else or is he like one of those like Americans that like converted. Well, I don't, I don't know if he's an American. Uh, maybe he might be an American. I, I don't know. Um, but like he, but nonetheless, regardless of his ethnicity, uh, he's like a very good YouTuber. So yeah, so yeah. Um, I recommend you guys like wa watch him. So yeah. Now, I have a second theory on why he got imprisoned. Yeah. You see, uh, the the, the Abdel Fattah is the president of Egypt. Yeah. He might be. There's a potential that he might be one of those weak, cuckolded, uh, liberal Muslims. No, no or semi-liberal Muslim. He, he hasn't, like, uh, removed the Islamic law from the Constitution yet. But but he might he might do it. I don't know. Um, now, this president, like, this president, there's a video of him, yeah? Yeah, there's a video of him. Of him like trying to deny the Sunnah and uh, and being a Hadith rejector, like a pseudo Hadith rejector. Now I don't know if he's a Hadith, an actual Hadith rejector, but he he is influenced. He's somewhat influenced from the like Quranists, the Quranists, uh, the Quranist uh, Hadith rejecting Muslims. This is like Quran and what is the Hadith rejecting uh, Quranist uh, like the the Hadith rejecting Quranist Muslim is like. A Muslim who rejects all of the Hadith and only goes with the Quran, of the Quran. Um, so yeah, like uh, a Quran, a Quranist Hadith rejecting Muslim is a, uh, is like a Muslim who like 
rejects all of the hadith and only goes by the Quran of the Quran. I always see, see the Quran. It's the Quran. The Quran. It's the Quran. So yeah, this is what the Quranist Muslim is. A Quran, Quranist uh, hadith rejecting Muslim is a Muslim that rejects all of the hadith and goes only by the Quran. Now this is like sect. Well, not sex, but like this, like these types of people are like they they tend to be like really liberal. Uh, they tend to like be pro secularism, like anti Islamic law. Like they don't don't want to cut the hands of the thief. They don't want to like cut the as the head of the murderer. Uh, they don't want to like put the the uh, the the state religion as Islam in Muslim countries. They're basically like secularists, as uh, they're like weak pussy uh, vagina liberal Muslims. So yeah, um, so yeah, and they have some influence over Egypt, unfortunately, unfortunately, and they have uh, some influence over our president, unfortunately, 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 and many people do not know this, do not know this, that Sisi is influenced by these people. Yeah. Now, now, Sisi might have imprisoned Ahmed Sabia because he felt uh, he felt like offended, uh, like triggered because of his videos, because uh, he saw Ahmed Sabia as a proud Muslim brother. Yeah, who's proud of his religion, who's happy, who who who's, who loves Allah, who loves Islam. Yeah, and he def uh, and he exposes the secularists. The secular scumbags, the secular liberal pussy scumbags, the, like Ibrahim Isa, yeah, and Islam Bahiri, yeah. The, well, let me show you the video. Let me show you the video. Yeah, there it is. There's, there's an awesome video. Yeah, there's Sharif Gaber, ACS YouTuber. There's Ibrahim Isa, the guy who made a show insulting the Sahaba and who defeated, who defeated Joseph Stalin, one of the biggest kafar in history. Yeah. And there is uh, Khaled Muntasser, Khaled Munhazim, uh, as I like to call him. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, this guy, uh, this guy, basically, like, uh, basically, like, uh, I see a lot of like Christians, like, uh, like a lot of, I see a lot of uh, Coptic Christians who hate Islam kissing his ass. Yeah. And uh, like, he's a secularist who's a, uh, who, who like, like a lot of people say he's an atheist who's trying to be like a, a Muslim. Uh, he, uh, I see a lot of people like calling him. Uh, uh, like uh, I see a lot of people. Would, I see, I see a lot of people thinking that he, he's not really a, a Muslim. There's Islam Bahiri, uh, the liberal uh, cock, who wants Christians to be able to become presidents of Egypt. Um, this cock, uh, this cuckold, uh, this homosexual. Um, now I'm insulting him. Like I don't, uh, I'm not saying he's an actual cock or like, uh, or a homosexual. Now he might be a homosexual. I don't know, <laughs> or a cock. I don't know. But like I'm just using it as an insult. Um, now this cock, this this homosexual. Yeah, this is recording. Yeah, it's recording. Okay. This cock, like basically, like this guy, this guy is on who influenced. Uh, the president of Egypt, uh, Abdel Fattah Sisi. This guy, like, who, like, influenced him was having, like, he, this guy influenced him, he, this guy influenced Sisi by making, uh, he influenced Sisi, Islam Bahiri, Islam al Bahiri, influenced Sisi by somewhat convincing Sisi that some of the hadith needs to be rejected and needs to be like, re, like you see, and this is uh, it, it, and, and needs to be like removed. So yeah, like he is it, like like he like he is, is this guy like encouraged CC to have like a somewhat like kind of Quranist beliefs, not not fully Quranist. I don't know if CC actually rejects all of the hadith. But like he, he, he like encouraged Sisi to have these types of beliefs. Now, Hamid Abdul Samad is an atheist, yeah? 
who hates Muslims and hates Islam and he has a YouTube channel insulting Muslims and Islam and he sides with ha Rashid, Rashid Habami, an apostate, yeah, who claims to be a Christian, who sides with people like David Wood, who sides with people like, uh, like, uh, like, um, like Magdi Khalil, uh, an Israel worshiping piece of trash, who claims to be Christian. So yeah. So yeah, guys. Uh, is, is, uh, so yeah guys, this is the video I recommend every Muslim to watch this video right now, immediately. This video is important. Now I already know that uh, there, there was like a secularist agenda in Egypt since like, uh, like I, I was already aware of the like secularist, Quranist, Hadith rejecting agenda that was going to, that was trying to be implemented in Egypt. So yeah. I was aware of of, of, of of their agenda since like 2015 so yeah 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 but like many people unfortunately do not talk about this I was aware of the like Hadith rejecting Quranist liberal agenda that was trying to be implemented in Egypt by these people over there so yeah guys so CC imprisoned him because uh, this guy was like a, a Muslim who, who who isn't liberal, who isn't like a Quran only like liberal uh, hadith rejecting Muslim, uh, and because uh, because uh, he made a, a, a behind of the seals deal with the Coptic Pope. So yeah, Ahmed Sabir got in prison because. CC does not like Ahmed Sabir because uh, um, Ahmed Sabir got imprisoned by CC because of his YouTube channel and because he made the behind uh, the scenes uh, deal with the Coptic poop and because uh, uh, Ahmed Sabir opposes or might be opposed because I don't know if CC like has this agenda or not but he might he's certainly influenced by it um yeah because uh Ahmed Sabir was in prison was also in prison because Ahmed Sabir opposes the agenda the agenda of CC to liberalize and secularize Egypt and CC might be a secret secret liberal and a secularist uh, so yeah yeah, but I don't, I don't think that. But I see, uh, I, I think he's somewhat like influenced by, by secularists and liberalists. Uh, uh, so yeah, yeah. Now I actually want to meet CC in real life, so I want to see if he actually is aware of of, of this happening, of the, of Ahmed Sabir being locked up. Like so, yeah. I want to see like if he, if he actually did it, yeah, and he did it, like for a reason that he wants to like secularize the country and secularize uh, secular and liberalize the, the Islamic laws of, of Egypt. Like then I I will hate him. I will absolutely oppo oppose and hate them. And now I don't fully hate him because like I don't know if, what is if he, if he actually imprisoned Ahmed Sabir or not. So yeah, so yeah, and I don't fully hate him because I don't know if he actually is trying to intentionally implement the, the agenda of the ex-Muslim territory atheists and the Hadith rejecting uh, Christ liberal Muslims, or is he just like? somewhat like influenced by them and deceived by them indirectly and he's doing this b uh, uh, stuff without realizing that he's furthering their agenda because I don't know because I don't know if CC is like um, because I don't know if CC actually knows that there's an agenda and is it, but I don't know because I don't know that CC 
because I don't know if CC knows that there's a, a group of rebels in Egypt that consists of like people like Abraham Isa, Khalid Muntasser, Islam al Bihari, Fatma Naoud. that are trying to um, secularize Egypt and try to uh, further their agenda so yeah I don't know this so yeah um, I don't know if he knows or not I, I don't know uh, I, I honestly don't know um, I should look way better with this, um, with this, like, with this being a far, like, I don't really look good in that webcam, I actually look better in real life, well, like, because the uh, angle of the camera that I'm in currently, it's kind of bad, um, I actually look better in, with, that, with my hair cut short, my hair is not usually that long, but it grows a lot, a lot really fast, so yeah. Interesting. Okay. Um yeah, I'm trying to like mix this. Okay. So yeah guys, um I recommend everyone here to watch Ahmed Sabia's like channel and like stay tuned for more videos. I plan to do way more videos today uh, today. Um so yeah, I, I hopefully I will. So yeah. So you guys have a awesome day. Um, I was just like checking the angles of my like computer. So you guys have an awesome day, and stay tuned for more videos.